So today's the day. We are getting ready to take off on our trip. We are packing the truck, getting everything ready to rock and roll. Darian's upstairs finishing everything off. So here we go. It's the uh, road trip of 2023, hitting Tennessee and all across the entire South. So you all wanted vlog style, y'all gonna get vlog style. We're about to have some fun, y'all. Here we go. All right, so we are cruising, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so a tradition that I do on any road trip, and I'm doing this as I'm driving, so, is, uh, yes, you feel. Hey, guys. <laughs> okay, so a tradition that I do on any road trip is we always blast Rascal Flats, uh, Life is a Highway. I don't think a road trip starts until that song is blasted through these speakers and we're being idiots and just screaming and laughing and just singing and having fun. So drop it in the comments if you all have your own pre something. Your uh, <laughs> if you all have a tradition that starts your all's vacation, uh, we'd love to hear about it. And uh, so yeah, drop those in the comments. We are rolling. We are making good time. Next check-in will be at the Arkansas State Line. All right, so we're making our first stop. We're just outside of Texarkana. We're about to finally get out of Texas. Three hours and 45 minutes later, we've been on the road rocking. Now, I don't know about y'all, but I gave her homework yesterday to create a playlist. And I didn't really give any rules, just have fun with it. So we're rolling, rocking and rolling, enjoying our songs, and all of a sudden, Justin Bieber came on the, on, on the on the radio and I about drove off the road. So, uh, <laughs> maybe give parameters next time, right, Chad? <laughs> but anyway, all right, we're rolling, having fun, and uh, gotta get some gas. <laughs> you got anything? Okay. Am I on? Yep. All right, stay in line for Arkansas. All right, the state line for Arkansas is right up here, so flip the camera around, Goofball. Uh, bam. Okay. What's up here, son? Are we there yet? <laughs> says Arkansas, shows Arkansas, so somewhere in here is up right there. Where? Right there. Oh, I see it. I see it. Alright, well we finally found Arkansas. <laughs> How do we zoom in? Oh, I got it. Alright, here we go. Three, two, Yay. one. Yay! We're in Arkansas! Arkansas. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> okay, next stop, our next check-in should be somewhere around Little Rock and then to Memphis for Graceland and everything Elvis for this one right here. into the drive and we are about to cross the Mississippi. In fact, we are over the Mississippi right now, actually, so she's going to flip it around and uh, we're about to end in Tennessee. Okay, there we go. So we're on I-55 right now crossing the Mississippi River. This has been a fun drive. She slept through a lot of it. Not really, just kidding. 
has been a blast. Are you getting the Mississippi? Uh, well, yeah. Are you getting this truck? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> crossing into Tennessee any, any time now. Is that it up there? No. The Arkansas state line is right up there. So Tennessee didn't even give a welcome to Tennessee sign on this bridge. I'm sure they did. They're right there. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh, oh MG oh, downtown oh. Memphis. All right. A lot of traffic. Wait, I want to get a picture of the sign, but okay, I'll just zoom in on it. All right, so you're multitasking right now. I'm multitasking. Wait, I need that thing to move. Got it. Thing. Yep. There it is. Wait. All right, so we're in Mississippi. Am I supposed to go? We're not in Mississippi. We're in Tennessee now. Oh, yeah, we're not in Tennessee. We're not in Mississippi. We're in Tennessee. You got this. <laughs> Good lord. All right, so we're in Memphis. Finally, check it out. Elvis Presley Boulevard. What a terrible spot to put on, on light. <laughs> so, super happy to be here. Now we're heading to the hotel, and we're actually staying at the guest house at uh, Graceland. Super excited for that, and I know this one is, for sure. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so check it out. Guest house at Graceland. So Graceland's right around here somewhere. I mean, it says Graceland Crossing. Graceland, up there. Oh. This is so crazy. <gasps> oh, bumpy. Yeah, it's pretty bumpy. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is really, really cool. Look at it. <laughs> it's so pretty. Well, you can't really see it. There's a tree in the way, but it's so pretty. Sneaky trees. Oh my gosh. That is a beautiful hotel, isn't it? Yeah. Dressed it's okay, we're not ghetto. It's alright. It's like you're gonna get canceled for that. Okay, so behind me is the guest house at Graceland. This hotel is fantastic. It's got restaurants, a pool, a fitness center, like a gym, and it's actually on Graceland. Graceland is just right, right on the other side of those trees is Graceland. So this place is really close, obviously. You take a shuttle across the street to the ticket place where all the museum and everything is and then depending on which package you buy to go over to Graceland you go over to Graceland you're taken care of you come back and we're right back here so this hotel is great I highly recommend it it's a little pricey but I mean it's right next to Graceland and everything in the hotel is Elvis like <laughs> obviously totally awesome could not be happier with this place so I highly recommend it if you come to Memphis, give this place a shot. You will not, if you're an Elvis person, you will not be disappointed. I guarantee, I guarantee. Okay, so we're in the guest house at Graceland and we just found this room. It's so cool. No idea what it is, but hey, we're here having fun. <laughs> okay, so every night they play a movie here in the theater in the hotel. And we just watched Elvis on tour totally cool what did you think it was pretty good it was pretty good she was on her phone the whole time no i wasn't <laughs> <laughs> but this place is totally awesome so uh yeah it was really cool yeah. <laughs> yeah yeah i'm so not used to looking over here it's just totally throwing me off no. okay so also every night at nine o'clock they serve peanut butter and jelly because that was one of elvis's favorite things was peanut butter and jelly so we are on our way to go get some PP&J. and j pp and j Peanut butter. You said PP&J. Oh. PB&J. PB&J. Not PP&J. <laughs> so as you can see, there's a Starbucks in this place. And the line is crazy. So one cool thing is you don't have to go off premises to get breakfast you can actually do it right here at a Starbucks <laughs> okay so we're walking up to the Graceland Museum right now we are not at Graceland see when you get off the bus 
And of course, Elvis is playing everywhere. We just got our tickets, got our passes to get over into Graceland and all the exhibits. Uh, they're really, really, really strict on videoing anything to do in, over in Graceland or the museum. And I can't put it on YouTube, but I might put some of the pictures on the Instagram pages. We'll see. But uh, this uh, is super exciting. Yeah, that right there shows it all, right? <laughs> All right, so I will show what I can show in Graceland, but probably not a lot. So, just, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so we left Graceland like an hour ago and completely forgot to record everything because one, we weren't recording in Graceland. You're not allowed to have any videos in there or in the museum. And plus it was hot and we were just ready to get back to the hotel. But now we're over in Beale Street. We're going to go up to Sun Records where everything started back in the 50s. And this building literally right over there, this, this building right here is Sun Records. So we're going to go check that out and hopefully record some stuff. <laughs> okay, so right now we're in the alley, I guess, behind it, walking up to it. But there you go, you can see it. We're going to come around the corner and we'll be there. So we're out here on the street, on Union Street and Marshall Avenue, and there it is. Elvis, BB King. A lot of them all started in that building right there. So we're going to go try to get in. I think we're both super, super excited. Okay, so the next tour is in an hour from now. So we are going to go to the Civil Rights Museum. It's about six minutes from here. We're going to check out the Lorraine Hotel where Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated. I think it's very important to always see history for what it is, not for what we want it to be, but for what it was. So we're going to go do something that I've wanted to do for a very long time. That's it, Darian. Oh my God. The wreath is the room. All right, so we made it. Uh, this is something I have always wanted to see, this hotel, just for the sheer historical sadness of what happened here. It just blows my mind that it's still here and then I get to bring my kid to see it. It's just, it's, it's very humbling. Okay, so standing here, I'm gonna be completely honest with everyone. It's, it's a humbling experience to be standing here. Um, kind of emotional. Like, <laughs> I'm actually very emotional being here. Um, right up there, let me flip the camera around. And there she is. Right up there, 306 is where that famous picture of everyone pointing over that direction. But that's where he, he died, right up there. So uh, if y'all ever get a chance to come to Memphis, there's more than just Elvis here. This is a turning point in American history, right up there on that second floor. So, uh, yeah. But like I said earlier, I'm a big history nerd, and history is what history is. It's not what we want it to be. And it's not all nice and pretty. There's ugliness in it. And it's important to learn it, so we don't relive it. But uh, I'm gonna turn this off and experience this with my kid. Okay, so we just went to the Lorraine Hotel, then we came all the way back to Sun, Sun Records, then we went to see the Elvis statue, because 
she was like, hey, we got 34 minutes to wait. Why don't we just go do something else? So we went and did something else and knocked it out. Now we're back here at Sun Records, ready to rock and roll. Get it? Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> okay, now it's gone. All right, we just finished the Sun Record Tour here at Sun Records. <laughs> All right, we just finished the Sun Record Tours. That thing was totally awesome. If you are into rock and roll, blues, the history of music, you got to come check this place out. It's the original place where Johnny Cash, Jerry Lee Lewis, Elvis, all were in that building right there. So cool. So cool. Drew was our... Uh, no, um, Drew was our tour guide? Tour guide. <laughs> he did a great job. And for $15, y'all, you cannot beat a 40-minute tour of literally music history right there. So, highly recommend it. Okay, so when you're in Memphis, you're always looking for barbecue, right? So here we are at Marlowe's, which was on Triple D, Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives. And one of the things that Darian and I love to do anywhere we travel is to find a restaurant that's on Triple D. So, we are gonna go in and give it a shot. Is this really how tall he was? I don't know, I guess. All right, so we found it. There he is, right there. <laughs> So cool. Elvis ate here. Elvis ate here. Okay, so I'll say right off the bat, this restaurant is very Elvis forward. I mean, look at that. It's Elvis. They even got the movie playing. So this one right here is super happy that she gets to watch her boy, Austin, right there. <laughs> Can't. Uh, I'm always looking in the wrong place. All right, so we just finished. I had the brisket. It was really, really good very good southern food she had the spaghetti a little watery but the flavoring was great so highly recommend checking this place out if you're down here around Graceland we're about a mile and a mile and a half from Graceland so very close and we're about to go to the gate and take a picture and put our name on the wall yes time to do that graffiti all right so we're at the wall of Graceland we have just tagged the wall <laughs> I already lost where I put mine. Mine's right there. <laughs> so Graceland is over there somewhere. And then Darian, right there. <laughs> so yeah. See if we can remember where we did this at, right there. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna walk down to the gate and get pictures in front of the world famous gate. And we're pretty much done with Memphis, to be honest. Tomorrow we get up, we roll out to Nashville, but uh, the trip here in Memphis has been great. Today was a lot of fun and uh, very memorable for me as a father and I think for her with me and all our goofiness. <laughs> to the gate and uh, <laughs> Right there is Graceland, where we were, what, eight, nine hours ago? Really, really cool. This fence is, this gate is so low. I mean, you can hear some crazy cars behind us. But, we walk up to the gates, check them out, and there they are. There they are. Go ahead, bro. Are you filming? Yep, I'm oh. filming. <laughs> All right, so let me stop this for now, take some pictures. All right, so it's morning three. We are heading to Nashville. Memphis has been fantastic. I highly recommend if you all have not been to Memphis, been to uh, Graceland, been to Sun Records, been over to see the Lorraine Hotel, any of the things to do here in Memphis, I... Uh, highly recommend coming this way it was an absolute blast having just a lot of fun here so uh, memphis is behind us literally and now ahead of us is nashville so we will check back in shortly okay so we're still on the road but i want to get the first video out so i'm going to stop the video right here break this into three parts and this will be part one which is just the beginning in memphis i hope everyone's enjoying the craziness between the two of us 
I did not edit a lot of this out. I'm just showing us talking and just being goofy and having fun and just trying to do a vlog style video. I'm not sure if this is gonna be good or not. I hope everyone enjoys uh, it. But this is part one. Part two will be coming out. That'll be us in Nashville. And then part three will kind of be us in Pigeon Forge and then the finale of our road trip. So those will be coming out over the next couple weeks. I'm gonna try to space them out or maybe I'll just drop them all at once. I'm not sure, but this has been a blast. I hope everyone enjoyed this video and we have more coming.